Hello friends welcome to Tricks Guru. Now, we are make, our videos worldwide. So, today's we are going to show you, how to tell, if your PC graphics card is going bad. A computer's graphics card, is integral to the operation, of a system by displaying your computer's data on a monitor, if the need arises, as it does for many small business owners, a high powered graphics card can be installed to allow, more power to various programs, however, when graphics cards is going bad, they can cause visual distortions or stop display a data completely before spending money on a whole new graphics card. However, figure out whether it's actually causing your problems. First, you need to check, swap monitors, hook up another monitor to your computer, and use your monitor with a different computer. This is designed to help you figure out if the monitor, not your graphics card, is going bad. If the visual distortions persist, the monitor is not the problem. If they are gone, however, this may be a sign that the monitor itself is going bad. Second you need, to check, card visibility. Remove the side panel from your computer's desktop tower, or laptop casing if you are able, and inspector's desktop tower, or laptop casing if you are able and inspect the graphics card for any signs of wear or damage. Graphics cards need to be kept cool, so remove any dust buildup. Also reseat the card by removing it from its slot and then placing it firmly back in. This will help you affirm that it hasn't come loose if there is any visible damage. However, this is a strong indicator that the graphics card is having issues and will need to be replaced. Third. You need to check, Device Manager. Open Device Manager to check on the status of your graphics card. Open Windows Control Panel, click System and Security and then click Device Manager. Open the Display Adapters section. Double click on the name of your graphics card and then look for whatever information is under Device Status. This area will typically say, this device is working properly. If it does not say this, take note of whatever warning or error might be listed there to seek help. Now, you need to check, startup functions. Listen to the sounds your computer makes when it starts up and try to perform basic functions, such as typing, opening the disk drive or plugging in an external USB device. This may be necessary if you can't see your screen at all. If your screen is completely blank, your motherboard may be at fault, not your graphic card. When your system starts up, try performing any of the aforementioned actions and also see if you can hear your hard drive working. There should be a few beeps right when you start and the computer should make noise apart from the fans spinning. If the computer starts normally, the graphics card is probably at fault. If not, it may be your motherboard. Thanks for watching your video friends.